Hey, what's up guys? How you doing? It is Lasty here. Welcome to a new episode of the Foothead Randomizer. Now, I set you guys a challenge for this episode in order to build me a hybrid squad featuring at least two transferred cards. We've done an episode based around winter upgrades uh, and therefore the other thing that EA released, of course, is transfers. So I wanted to see what sort of squad you guys could build. Uh, and as I can see by the little images on the screen, you probably can't see them just yet. Uh, I've got the likes of uh, El Shirawi, Pato, people like that that are coming up. Uh, which would be pretty good because they are some of the more overpowered transferred players I guess you could say. Now this is actually like the second episode of the Foothead Randomizer this week because I posted the last episode a few days later than planned um, so there hasn't been as much time for you guys to build squads therefore we've got currently around 200 squads built for us this week um, if you'd like to try and get that number up by next week that would be pretty awesome as well and uh, the rules for next week uh, well it's Wednesday uh, quarter past three for me as I'm recording this right now which means basically they've just announced the team of the week and I've seen an 87 rated Griezmann that I really wouldn't mind getting my hands on so I think that's a squad that you guys should build for me a nice hybrid featuring this 87 rated third informed Griezmann um, I don't care how much he costs you're gonna have 250k to spend on the rest of the squad so 250k on the squad plus whatever Griezmann costs is what you can spend Xbox prices uh, and you need to label the squad foothead lasty 16 that's the only way I'm gonna see it Let's get a nice hybrid going guys uh, and as many of you can build the squads as possible that would be absolutely awesome So like I said around 200 squads built for us this week Boom we'll generate a number and we get to use squad number 59 in today's video Let me go and find it Okay guys I have found today's squad it is this one right here Made by a guy called Bassist141 I think that's how you pronounce his name But thank you very much bro I really appreciate you building a squad And the rest of you 200 of you that have built squads for me You're freaking epic and I love you You make this series happen So it looks like this guy's built us a 433 fourth variant That's one of my favourite formations We've got 5 leagues 5 nations uh, six times four star skillers and it's no links wasted if there's a couple of transfers in here Then I'm pretty sure this squad's gonna be godly. So we'll check it out in three two one boom uh, Let's go. What are we using today? Oh, that is rather nice, isn't it? Okay So my transferred players are El Shirawi and Pato are there any more? It doesn't matter. We've got enough right now. There is a Valdez who's transferred as well. Um, I'm a little bit worried that El Shirawi has just been given a new inform on Ultimate Team. So I'm not sure if buying this one is going to be a complete waste of coins. Because in a few hours for me, when that second inform El Shirawi is released, it's going to uh, like absolutely drop the price of this one. But so be it. We'll live with that. Uh, and I will go ahead and build this squad. I'll meet you on the console once I've done so in just a second. Alright, so we made it over to the console, and this squad is actually looking pretty tasty, I'm not going to lie. Um, the only player that's different from, actually, what the squad was built on Foothead is Oscar. I couldn't afford his inform. Literally, after building the Footwiz randomizer and this squad, I was down to 1,000 coins, so... A little bit brassic at the moment, which is a bit of a problem, but I'm sure I just need to sell some players and stuff like that. Uh, we are... I'm liking the look of it. It's Serie A. It's uh, a little bit of La Liga, BPL, and Bundesliga. Good times ahead. Uh, Mkhitaryan, Inform, Pato, and of course El Shirawi. Looking forward to using that front three. Let's go into a game and see who we come up against today. Okay, coming up against our opponent today, we're going to be facing... A full-on Bundesliga team, and a very strong one at that. We've got upgraded Chicharito, the likes of Royce, Mkhitaryan, Vidal. Oh, God, Naldo at the back as well. Upgraded Farman. Oh, God, I'm nervous. This is a strong team to play. It's not a very interesting team because, of course, it is just one league. Now, last week on the Foothead Randomizer, I literally didn't manage to score, um, which was a problem, so... No matter what happens today, my aim is to score a goal. <laughs> I think we need to take it back and uh, literally just go with easy easy targets. And uh, that is my target today, to at least score a goal. Um, <laughs> it may be a simple one, but we're going for it. Go on, Mkhitaryan. You've still got it. No, you haven't. You've lost it. And it's lagging. And again, you turn him. Oscar, hit that ball. Oh, wide of the post. That could have been my goal. Uh-oh. Out wide to Mkhitaryan. He's going to cut inside. I've misread that. And that. No, 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 no. Oh, Valdez saves. Uh-oh. <laughs> we've got someone who knows some skill moves. That's that's one thing that we've learned straight away here. He's whipped that in back post as well. Hit the post with Vidal. Just get out. Get out, please. Right, he's out of position now. Play that. And again, one more. That's a lovely ball to Oscar. Oscar. 
Back post. Pato. Go in. It's gone in. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> We've done what we couldn't do in the last episode. However, that has got to be one of the world's disgusting, sweaty, horrible goals. Um, and I'm not even sorry, to be honest. I could have shot with uh, Oscar, but the chances of it going in near post with Farman in goal were a lot slimmer than if we played it across the goal and got that dodgy one there with Alexander Pato. Over to Elshar. Not Elshar, to Pato. Play it one more. Mkhitaryan sticks it in the back of the net and we're 2-0 up. <sighs> Again, I didn't know if I could run through with Pato right there, whether or not it would have just been saved. So I played it off to him. I don't know if you class that as sweaty or not. What do you think, guys? We're through here, but is that player going to tackle me? He probably is. Smart move is to play that out wide, and Mkhitaryan, of all people, has put us 2-0 up. Not 2-1, 2-0. I'm happy. I'm happy. Oh, God. Sergio Ramos, I need you, mate. Take the tackle. Oh, that is a perfect tackle. Keep it in. Oh, Deepmeyer's even played it out for a throw-in. We like that. That was actually some pretty good defending. Apart from I made the mistakes that he managed to get into the positions to shoot, but... You know, we'll forget about that. Get that away. Come on, get it out. Referee has given him a free kick. Ah, oh, 45th minute AIDS is about to happen. And you know it, boys. You know it's going to happen. It's going in. Just get it away. Maybe we can take advantage of the AIDS. Oh, we've done him. We are through. But Hummels is catching up a player with crazy pace right now. No, he's not. No, he's not. Mkhitaryan. Oh, saved by Farman. He is a godly keeper. I don't know how I was ever going to score that. Take the shot. Oh, fuck. He's played it off. And surely the ref will call the half-time whistle. He has done. And we are 2-0 up at the end of the first 45 minutes. Less possession than our opponent. Um, but actually more shots. Although the same amount actually on target. As you can see by the stats right there. He's had better shot accuracy. Better pass accuracy. Maybe we need to work on those in the second half. Um, I could do with one more goal, really, to be honest, to solidify this one. Because 2-0, as I've said before, is, is a very a dangerous position to be in. Oh, shit. My passing's gone terrible. Uh-oh. He's got that with Chicharito. He's played it inside and he's scored. Like that, out of nowhere, we've let a goal in. And that's because I'm playing like an idiot now that I'm too comfortable. God damn it. I'm now more nervous about losing this game than I am winning it. Well, you know, confident in winning it. Yes, turned him, passed it, got past him, going past the next one, play it out wide now, cut it inside now, play it back, spin him, Oscar, oh, saved by Farman, I knew exactly what I was doing there, apart from the shot, god damn it. Yes, good ball in, Pato, woohoo, that's a sick goal. It's a header at the end of the day, but El Sharawi's dribbling there and a killer ball into the box and a really, really nice header restores our two goal lead and I'm now feeling a little bit more comfortable. Nice one. Over to Pato. I've got to try and think this over. Oh, and cut it back inside and outside again. Hit it, hit the shot. Oh, that's the worst. <laughs> Such a bad shot. El Shar burst it out wide. Berber spin in. Cut it back. You've still got it. Back post. Oh, no one was there then. Get it out. Get it out. If he scores now, we're buggered. Oh, okay. Has he blown the final whistle? I don't think he has. Whew, the pressure's not letting off. Come on. Just get this. Head this away. Head it out. Boot it out, Marquisio. There we go. Blow that whistle and we win the game. Convincingly, three goals to one. That was a much better performance, actually, than last time. Um, although I think last time's performance was pretty good. We just didn't manage to score. This guy can score goals. Alex Pato. That's, that was a pretty good performance from him. Um, I really liked El Sharawi. So my two transfers were very good players in today's video. Don't forget the rules for the next episode are on your screens. It would be awesome for as many of you as possible to go ahead and go and build some squads right now. Um, and before you do that, smash a thumbs up on the video for me. That would be greatly appreciated. And subscribe to my channel if you are new around here. Thanks so much for watching. Catch you next time, boys. Peace.